Hello everyone. <clears throat> Today we're gonna make an animation in the JavaScript. All right. So I'm gonna show you how to make a small animation in the JavaScript. Okay, here is the index.html file. Right. So let's see what it does. <clears throat> so this is how it looks like. Write a function called dollar and pass the parameter for the key, and then you can return document dot query selector. You can just pass the key. This is your helper function. Call back <clears throat> div and index. Let's see, let's attach some event on it. Function. Index. So index is zero, one. The for each function is working properly. So let's uh, add some edit animation on it. So let's say if you want to add a blur effect, right? So what we actually need is we want to specify the opacity. Let's say close to one, right? And then if Interval and let's say the effect is N only. Now, <clears throat> if you want to have a blur effect, 
we have to decrease the opacity of the div element, right? So one and decrement by here the dot style dot opacity goes to opacity minus zero point zero one right adding this effect will give you the following result nothing is happening it's okay no problem because there is the error nothing is happening is not defined that's okay e dot this is how the effect is now if you want to clear the build if capacity is less than or equals to zero clear interval and I'll display to none adding that <coughs> style set will actually hide the spot so it's a fade out fade out event fade in event <coughs> or if you want to write a slide down right you can do something another for example style dot height equals to height equals to let's say 100 plus pixel then you can do height minus minus so let's see what it happens oh that's a cool effect right oh so writing this small app <clears throat> small line of codes will actually help you write your own blur effect as well as slide up if you do not have the jQuery you can write using this simple code to make your script workable thank you very much